Well, tonight, wizards from across the country gathered in San Francisco for the official reopening part of Harry Potter and the Cursed Child at San Francisco's Kern Theater. Mayor London Breed calling it a milestone in the city's reopening since the theater sh uh, shut down nearly two years ago because of COVID. The economy is a key part of building a better Bay Area. And tonight, ABC 7 News reporter J.R. Stone was at that theater and has more of the excitement. Harry Potter fans here, there, and everywhere you looked outside San Francisco's Koran Theater Thursday night for opening night of Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. Not having the arts was definitely hard. Reopening night is probably a more accurate term for those who waited in long lines to see Thursday's show. The exact one that was canceled in 2020 due to the pandemic. The theater was then closed for 660 days until the soft opening last month. Mayor London Breed! I gotta say, this is really icing on the cake as we start to reopen our city and recover from this pandemic. San Francisco and New York City are the only two U.S. locations where this Harry Potter show can be seen. In fact, many we talked with made a long journey to get here. I'm from Potsdam, New York. We flew here today all the way from the other side of the country. Those here were excited to take pictures, drink butter beer, and enjoy Harry Potter among other diehards. They say it's been a very long pandemic. I have felt very cooped up. A long time. A lot of video games. Thank you, PlayStation 5. <laughs> Always been a huge geek and just this is incredible. Here we are today celebrating what I think is an extraordinary milestone after dealing with a global pandemic. Thanks to our audiences, the magic has now returned to San Francisco. As for those who might be interested in coming to watch this Harry Potter performance, it runs through September 4th. J.R. Stone, ABC 7 News. How nice is that to see everyone so excited and the arts beginning to come back to life in this great city, Em. Yeah, but they were eager to get inside because it's pretty cold. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it is indeed. As a matter of fact, tomorrow morning before you head out the door, Dan and Am